Uno, dos. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, everyone. How are you doing? Good evening. Good evening. Hello, how are you? Fine, thank you. And you? Fine. Everything is nice. Welcome on board. Okay. Uh, good evening. Sorry. Welcome on board. Okay. Yeah, Welcome. thank you. <laughs> yes. Welcome to the class. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's let's begin. Good evening. Today is August the 25th, and this is the pre-intermediate two. Okay. Our schedule is from eight to nine. We start a little earlier to finish uh, earlier too. <laughs> okay, we finish at nine, exactly at nine. So for that reason, we, fin we start early. Okay, tonight we're going to be working on adverbs of frequency. Adverbs of frequency to talk about how often we do things. Okay, so in the agenda tonight, we have adverse of frequency, asking about frequency, pronunciation, direct ad address, sports and athletes, and conversation, I'm a real fitness freak. I'm a real fitness freak. Okay, so these are the things to study tonight. The objectives, to discuss sports and exercise. Okay, review. Do you remember what we studied yesterday? Yeah, we studied the, um, the exercise. Uh -huh. we, we talked about exercising. Uh -huh. Yes. Discuss the benefits of exercising. And there were many, many benefits of exercising, right? Yes. Right. Okay. Um, Claudita, do you remember what we studied yesterday? Good evening. Um, we studied... Uh frequency that we do exercise and, and some sports, some uh, fitness activities. Excellent. Yes, you remember a lot. Very good. Thanks. Don Rafael had already told me too. Okay. Nice. Let's continue. Okay. Fitness poll. Okay, we have, uh, <clears throat> we're going to have volunteers. First, we're going to have Don Rafael asking the first question. Don Rafael, would you please ask question number one to the person that you prefer? Sure. Do you have a regular fitness program? How often do you exercise? Okay, let's see, who, who do you want to ask?
It can be anybody, someone that you want to ask. Okay, we can ask Don Rolando Bautista. Can you answer the first question, please? Do you have a regular fitness program? How often do you exercise? We need to share. Do you have a regular fitness program? How often do you exercise? Mm -hmm. Uh, can you answer the question? Okay. Let me see. I'm going to say it in a different way. Mm -hmm. um, who wants to answer question number one? Do you have a regular fitness program? How often do you exercise? Okay, one possible answer can be, yes, I have a regular fitness program. I usually go to the gym three times a week and I try to exercise for an hour and a half those three times that I go to the gym, okay? So that can be the answer to question one. Or you can say, no, I don't have a, a regular fitness program. I exercise only when I have time. And that is on weekends. I go to the gym on Sundays or I go jogging on Saturdays. Okay. So, question number one one volunteer? Uh, no, I don't have a regular fitness program. Um, I exercise once a month. <laughs> I don't know. I don't exercise. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Claudita. Thank you very much. Very kind. Noemi, what about you? How do you answer the question? No, teacher. I don't have a regular fitness program because I don't have a time uh -huh. to go to the gym. For uh, some months ago, I went to to uh, aerobics. To aerobics class. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, at this moment, I can't go. Ah, <laughs> okay, you can't go. Well, but actually, Claudita and you are very young, so no problem. No problem right now. Even though work walking is or running is good, okay. Thank you, thank you for sharing. Okay, let's move to question number two. Uh, Noemi, would you like to ask question number two, please? And you select the person. Me, teacher? Yes, please. Okay. Um, Cristia Muñoz. Okay. Christian do Muñoz. You ever... Okay. The question, okay. It seems like um, he's not, not listening probably. Okay. Can, uh, I, can I select other person? Yes, please. Select. Okay. Um, Vanessa. Do you ever go to the gym? Sorry? Do you ever go to the gym? Um, I, 
I never go to the gym. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> okay, that's it. Because if she says no to the first question, the other one. Thank you, Vanessa. Thank you very much. <laughs> Now, Vanessa, can you ask the question to another person? You select the person. Uh -huh. Only you, you need to activate the microphone. Sorry, teacher, sorry. Uh, Florence Magaña. <laughs> Florence Magaña, okay. Uh, Florence. Um, do you ever go to the gym? Hi. Uh, I almost never go to the gym now, but only um, five years ago, I went to the gym sometimes. Okay. Oh, okay, thank you, Florence. Thank you, Vanya. Thank you, Florence. Okay. Now, the next question. Uh, Florence, would you please ask question number three to somebody that you choose? Okay. Um, Rafael, do you play any sport? Which ones? How often do you play? Yes, I do. I play tennis. I play once a month. Okay. Do you play with a particular group of friends? Or do you belong oh. to a club? Sorry? Do you play with a particular group of friends? Or do you belong to a club? No, I don't have a particular group of friends. I go with a friend mm -hmm. and when I when I have time we are coordinated. Ah, okay. Excellent. Yeah, tennis is is difficult, right? Yes. It's but, I, but I have played since Mm, 20 years ago. Wow. Okay. It's a long, long time since so you have experience. Okay. Right. Yeah, that's nice. Okay. Now, would you please ask the next question? Uh, question number four, and you select the person. Okay. Uh, Luis Alonso. Hello. Do you ever take long walks? How often? Where do you go? Sorry, please. Do you ever take long walks? How often? Where do you go? Uh, uh... I, I don't uh, I don't take uh, long walks. I I walk um poquito. ¿Cómo se dice poquito? A little, a little, mm -hmm. a little, a little, a little, teacher. <laughs> okay, you walk a little. Yes. From um... a little. Uh, from your office to your car. Hmm? Do you walk from your office to your car now? 
Ah, in, in my office and on, on car. <laughs> uh -huh. So you you don't walk then. Okay. Well, thank you very much. Okay. Thank you very much. Now, can you ask uh, Don Luis Alonso Mendoza, can you ask a question, please? Can you choose the person? Uh, Well, um, Cesar Oviedo. Yes. The, the center five teacher. Exactly. Uh, question five teacher. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Um, uh, Cesar, what else do you do uh, to keep fit? Uh, also, excuse, excuse me, uh, I think. Mm -hmm. I'm going to paraphrase the question. What other activities do you do to stay in good shape? What other activities do you do to, to be in good shape? Okay, uh, I, I have um running i have stretch stretching uh, i do i'm um, to um, jump and oh jumping. Yoga. or jump, you jump. yoga or you go jogging and uh, no, uh, then jump jump the, the jump uh, you jump jump and Con, con la cuerda. Ajá, ok. That is what people call eh, the rope. So you skip so, the rope. Mm -hmm. and anytime. I'm going to write it here for you to see it. Ok. Let me see. Ok. Skip. The rope. No Mickey teacher, it's very small. Don't worry, make it bigger. Okay, skip the rope. Skip the rope. Rope is the cuerda, right? So skip the rope. Okay. Skip the rope. Skip the rope. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much. Don Cesar Oviedo, let's continue. Exercise one. That was just to warm up. Now let's get into adverbs of frequency. Okay, there are some uh, adverbs that is specifically tell us the frequency in which we do things. For example, if we do something 100% of the times, it is always. He's always very punctual. I'll see if he's here yet, okay? Because he's very punctual, okay? Means every time, every time you are there, on time, you are always punctual. Now, you always study hard means every day you study hard. Now, 90% usually, we usually go to the restaurant on Sundays, means maybe not 100% every Sunday, we go to the restaurant, maybe one Sunday in three or four months, we don't go, but we usually go, okay. 80% generally, we generally go to the sea for our holidays. Okay, we go to the beach for our holidays, for our free time. 70% often. They often went caroling at Christmas. Okay, they often went caroling at Christmas. Teacher, what is caroling? 
Caroline is when you go and sing uh, Christmas songs. Christmas songs like last Christmas, I gave you my heart. You remember those songs like that? Or um, Frosty the Snowman, Frosty the Snowman, etc. Those, okay, are Christmas carols. So the, the activity of singing them is caroling, right? So they went caroling at Christmas. What's, what's the meaning? They sang Christmas carols together, okay? You know, on this occasion, Christmas, December the 25th. Okay. Often, that is talking about often, 50%. Sometimes, sometimes can be in three positions. You say, sometimes I just need someone to talk to. Okay, I sometimes just need someone to talk to. Or you can put it at the end. I just need someone to talk to sometimes. Only the, the pronunciation is a little different, but sometimes. Sometimes, I just need someone to talk to. I just need someone to talk to sometimes. Okay, 30% occasionally, or that is on occasion. We occasionally meet for a drink after work. Okay, 15% seldom. I seldom worry about my future. Seldom worry about my future means mm, I almost never, right, uh, worry about my future. 5% is rarely. Peter, Hello? what is seldom? Seldom means that is not very frequent, okay? Almost never. Oh. Uh, here they, they give you like 15%. Uh, they, these percentages, sometimes they are not exact. Okay, sometimes okay, thank you. I can give you an idea. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you for your question, Lisette. So it's more like rarely 5%, seldom like 15% of the time. I seldom worry about my future. Rarely, she's old and rarely goes out. She's afraid of falling down, okay? Never. I never take a shower. No, I mean, I don't aim high. You will never hit high, okay? So never is 0% of the times, right? Other examples similar to this are here, okay? We have 100% uh, is always, 0% is never. And between making a sandwich, we have the others, okay? Always, almost always, usually, often, sometimes, hardly ever, rarely, seldom, almost never, and never. You say, teacher, I have problems with the pronunciation. Don't worry. I'm going to try to put the pronunciation here. Uh, say all ways like this, maybe. And the stress here. Let me see. Maybe like this. Uh oh, oh, I erase the, <laughs> I erase, erase the rest. Well, no problem. It's nothing that I cannot fix right now. Okay, something like this. Probably we make it smaller. Okay, for the others to fit. Always, always, right? Always, 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 always. Teacher, I have a question. Tell me, please. I'll almost never is equal rarely? Uh, maybe, could be. Almost never is like 1% of the time. Like for example, uh, if you do something once a year, 
could be almost never. When do you go to the gym? I almost never go to the gym. I went to the gym last year. And you say, ah, okay, almost never, right? Similar to seldom, similar to seldom. Okay, this is pronounced rarely, rarely, okay? Rarely. Rarely. Let me uh, stress it here, rarely. And uh, this is pronounced usually. This is almost, almost. So people have problems with all and then most. Okay. Stress here always on all. Okay. Let me see. Almost. Then the same almost always, right? And here is usually. You schwa. Okay, usually, 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 usually. Okay, usually, usually, usually. Often, this the T is not, you can say often, some people say often, but normally it's often. Okay, let me see. Something like this, often, often right, often. And sometimes people use here, often times, often times. Sometimes or often times is okay. Hardly ever, seldom, almost never, and never. So this would be the, some of the frequency words, 10 to be precise. Okay, then some examples. How often do you exercise? This, has, this is the normal question for frequency. How often do you exercise? I lift weights every day. I go jogging once a week. I play soccer twice a month. I swim about three times a year. I don't exercise very often, okay? I don't exercise very often. But you can say, how often do you exercise? Like the question here. I exercise once a week. Teacher, what is once a week? One time, once, twice, three times, okay? Once, twice, three times, okay? One, twice, oh, four times, <laughs> okay. So one time, Okay, one repetition, right? Once, two repetitions, twice, three repetitions, three times. So you say, and you say a week, a month, a year. Uh, okay, I exercise once a week. You can say I exercise once a month or ex I exercise once a year. You say, wow, once a year, okay? I exercise twice a week. I exercise three times a week. Or you, some people say, exercise? What's that? I never exercise. Okay, exercise? What's that? I never exercise. So it can be like that too. Now, okay, uh, the, other, the other is, do you ever, do you understand the word ever? Do you understand ever? Okay, ever is alguna vez, right? So in a question, do you ever watch a TV in the evening? This is alguna vez. So is, if you're asking alguna vez, watch TV in the evening? And you say, yes, I often watch TV after dinner. I sometimes watch TV before bed. Sometimes I watch TV before bed. I hardly ever watch TV. Hardly ever is, ooh, okay, like rarely, right? Hardly ever is similar to rarely. Or no, I never watch TV. 
never is not ever. Not ever. If you say ever is alguna vez, not ever is ninguna vez. Ninguna vez, right? Never. I never watch TV. Okay, so do you ever watch TV in the evenings? Yes. I sometimes watch TV before bed. Or no, I never watch TV. Okay. Now I ask you here. Uh, Don Rafael, do you watch TV? Do you ever watch TV in the evening? Mm, yes, I do. Mm -hmm. uh, how often? Um, three times a week. Three times a week. For how long? Mm, for one, one hour. One hour every time. Okay. Yes. Thank you very much. Very good. Okay. Don Cesar Oviedo, what about you? Do you ever watch TV in the evening? Uh, and sometimes I watch TV before night. Uh, usually um, 10 p.m. o'clock. 10 p.m. Ah, okay. Yes, after the class, right? <laughs> after the class. Yeah, before is not possible, of course. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. And you, Lisette, do you watch TV? Do you ever watch TV in the evening? Uh, when I when I was ten, when I often. Time. Sorry. When you have time. Uh, I watch TV when the week. On the week. Only week. On the weekend. On the weekends. Ah, okay. Excellent. Very good, thank you for sharing. So, mm -hmm. on weekends, okay, excellent, very good. And you, Don Luis Alonso, do you ever watch TV in the evening? Uh, uh, yes, teacher, I sometimes watch TV on on weekend uh, the, twice a uh, a day on weekend twice a day three, three times uh, three times uh, or three times in uh, on weekends uh, three times in the in the morning in the afternoon and in the evening correcto oh. yes it's correct. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. <laughs> yeah. On, on, on weekend, teacher, uh, on, uh, all the uh, in the on the all all day. Um, uh, on, sería almost never, almost never, and almost every never. day, only on weekend. Only on weekends. Excellent. Yes. Thank you, Don Alonso. Thank you very much. Now, some because someone was asked, do you drink? He says, uh, yes, I drink, really, mm -hmm. four times a year, only four times a year. Ah, okay, you don't have problems with alcohol, only four times a year. Yes, he said, in winter, in spring, in summer, and you know, in fall. <laughs> so all the year round, so he, he drank, so. But no, you say only on weekends. You watch TV only on weekends. That's very good. Excellent. Nice. Okay, let's continue. Do you have any questions so far? Questions? Vanessa, do you have any questions? Lillian, Florence? No teacher. No teacher, it's clear. Excellent. Well, okay. Very good. Now, if you have no questions, let's continue. Wonderful. Okay, we're going to do this exercise.
Okay, for this, I need two people for each exercise. The instructions say, put the adverbs in the correct place, then practice with a partner. Okay, um, what do we have to do? This is an example, okay? This will be the example. Ever is here, right? This is the one that you need to insert. Insert, okay, we have to say. Insert the word in the sentence, okay? But I'm not going to write the rest. Insert the word in the sentence. Example, do you play sports? So do you ever, so you put here ever, right? Do you ever play sports? Let's see, I'm going to show you where it is unfair. I don't show you. So let me see. Oh, no, that's, that's a bad thing. Okay, let me see. Let me. Okay, so you put it here where the arrow is. Okay, in this place, do you ever play sports? Okay, do you ever play sports? And this one is in this position because every day, twice a week, three times a week, et cetera, they go at the end, at the end of the sentence. So do you ever play sports? Sure. I play soccer twice a week. Do you ever play sports? Sure, I play soccer twice a week. So do you ever play sports? Sure, Teacher. soccer twice a week. Mm -hmm. Is this yeah. correct place? Oh, nope. It's <laughs> okay. I think uh, that there is a, mis a little mistake, very big mistake. <laughs> Place is a different thing. Let me let let me put the correct thing. Imagine. Thank you for telling me. Okay, me no Mickey, but my computer. Yes, I'm going to. Voy a culpar a mi computadora. Okay, so don't. Worry. Okay, <laughs> my com my computer uh, wrote it there, but it's play. Okay. Sure, I play soccer twice a week, no place. Okay, thank you. Thank you for showing me the mistake. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, wonderful. And where do you put twice a week? At the end of the sentence. So what do we say? Uh, do you ever play sports? Sure, I play soccer twice a week. Okay, I need the volunteers for number two. Okay, I have uh, Noemi and I have Karina. Okay, Karina is A, Noemi is B. Okay, thank you. What do you usually do on Saturday mornings? Mm -hmm. Noemi? Well, nothing much. I almost always sleep until noon. Wonderful. Excellent. Good answers. Thank you very much. Now for number three, I have Rosario in Lillian. Rosario asks Lillian. Okay. Do you often do aerobic at the gym? Sure, I go to the, the to the gym three times. Uh, uh, I think to read the letter B. Is letter B this one? Ah, uh, mm -hmm. uh, yes, see, okay. I 
No. I do. Okay, no. No, I, I do often. I, no, I, I no, sería. perdón, 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 sí. No, I, I, I no, sería, no, no, I don't. Eh, no, 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 no. Okay, ajá, let me, eh, why not? And then, Doña Lilian continues. Okay, sí. we, Doña Lilian, finish, please. And then I will explain. No, I don't uh, hardly ever. Do? Pero, do I, no, I do. No, her, I hardly ever do. Uh, okay, no, I hardly ever do aerobic. Excellent, very good, that's correct. No, I hardly ever do it. Okay, um, hardly ever is negative, right? Imagine that, yes. you're, that you say in Spanish, rara vez, se lo voy a decir en español así. Uh, mm -hmm. No, yo rara vez hago aerobicos. Okay, you don't need to say negative because rara vez is negative. Uh -huh. Okay, so for this reason, right? So uh, no, I hardly ever do aerobics. Okay, that would be this. It's similar to never. No, I never do aerobics. For example, the negatives here would be probably beginning here. No, I hardly ever do. Okay, uh, do you ever watch TV in the evenings? No, I hardly ever do. No, I rarely do. No, I seldom do. No, I almost never do. No, I never do. I'm going to write here the answer. You say, no, uh, only that I will place my microphone somewhere for a moment. Okay, this is an example, right? No, I rarely do. No, I hardly ever do. No, I seldom do. No, I almost never do. Okay, and in affirmative, you do the same. You do the same except that you say, let me see if I can do it with one hand. Yes. Okay, ho ho, I twisted the eye. No, but not my eye, only this. Okay, let me see. I always, maybe. Uh, yeah, of course. Thank you. Say like this, and you say do. So you say, yes, I always do. Yes, I almost always do. So do you ever watch TV in the evenings? Yes, I always do. Yes, I almost always do. Yes, I usually do. Yes, I often do. Yes, I sometimes do. So you see that we have five affirmative and five negative. Uh -huh. I'm going to put your division here, okay? I'm going to put you a division here for you to see where one finishes and the other starts. Okay, sorry that is not very straight. Uh, I'm going to blame, this time I'm going to blame my mouse, okay? I have to blame someone. <laughs> no problem. Say blame, culpar. <laughs> blame is culpar. Voy a culpar al mouse ahora. Okay, so I'm going to blame the mouse. Okay, so, okay, my dear niñitos, check over here. Uh, do you, do you ever, alguna vez, alguna vez ves televisión? Do you ever watch TV? Alguna vez vas al parque? Do you ever go to the park? Alguna vez comes aguacate? Do you ever eat avocado or avocado, whatever you prefer? Do you ever eat avocado? And you can, the answer 
is do you ever with the do you ever question the answer is yes i usually do yes i sometimes do yes i always do or no i hardly ever do no i never do no i seldom do no i rarely do okay but these are short answers okay short answers. The complete answer is more like this. Yes, I often watch TV after dinner. Not if there is a complete thing. It's the full tamale, okay? So I often watch TV after dinner, okay? Excellent. Now let's continue. Uh, uh, teacher, I have, uh, tell me please. Yes, tell me. Can you write uh, answers, the first uh, uh, complete, please? The complete for- Yes, uh, uh, no, next. This one. Next presentation, uh, presentation. This one? No, no, the exercise. I put, uh, put the words in color play. Oh, this one, this one. Yes, of course. And B. Let me see. A. Let me write. Let me write. Okay. I'm going to make the letter smaller though because it will be much better. I think should be smaller. Let me see. You will it allow me? That's another question. Now I'm going to do it in a different way. No problem. Don't panic. Okay, we're going to say first question, uh, first answer, the perfect question. Aha, uh -huh. uh, the first the, question. The, the uh, first. Don't worry, I'm going to write the two. No. Oh, too much, too big. Okay, it's because of the combination of, of keys. Let's see. Okay. No, you say no, I hardly ever. No, I hardly ever do aerobics, right? No, I hardly ever do aerobics. Okay, now the, the question, this would be like, and twice a week is ever or no ever? Oh, twice a week uh, is an uh, is a frequency. Uh, well, it's an adverbial. I would say frequency. I'm going to ah, that's the one that you want. Okay, don't worry. I'm going to write it too. So, do you often? Do you often do aerobics? at the gym? Mm. Oh, oh. Hey, hey. Let me undo this part, the last part. Uh-huh, yeah, I know what happens. Ta -ta 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 -ta. No, I don't know what happened. <laughs> okay, so uh, I wanted to write it, but the combination of keys only with one hand, I can't. I'm going to put down my microphone. Let's see. Do you ever do you ever play sports? Okay. Mm 
Okay. <laughs> it's funny that this went up all the way up. No problem. Okay. I'll put it here. I Does this answer your question? Sure, I play soccer twice a week. Don Oviedo, does this help you? Um, my question is uh, twist, twist a week? Um, I don't a bird or yes a bird? Twice. E I, twice, twice a bird. Uh, no, no, no. Eh, twice a week es un adverbio, o sea, una, una fracción adverbial. So this is, this is the verb, play, play is the verb. The thing is that here I made a mistake. I put place, but place no, it's play. I play soccer twice a week. Play is the verb. This is the verb, this is not a verb. Uh, it, uh, my question is for, uh, usually a verb uh, before the verse, a verb before the verse, and twist a with uh, um, after the verse. Okay. And what you're saying. Let me see. Uh, not necessarily, not necessarily. So I'm going to abuse this poor pow uh, presentation PowerPoint here. <laughs> I'm going to write it here. Okay, uh, let me see, bear with me. Check the two sentences. Okay. Every day is an adverb of frequency too. So um, I always, um, I'm missing it. Uh, okay. Now, yes. I always eat lunch at 12.30 p.m. I eat lunch every day. Notice, every day has the characteristic that always goes at the end. Always, okay. The ones that go before the verb are these ones. Always, almost always, usually, often, sometimes. And these are adverbs of frequency. The others are adverbials of time. Even though adverbials of frequency, like uh, twice a week, et cetera, those are adverbials of frequency too. I'm going to put them here. Thank you. Okay. Twice a week. Once a month. Um, three times. A year. Okay. Let me tell you that these ones are at the end of the sentence. I eat lunch twice a week. Ah, uh, not teacher. You are patito. You eat uh, nine times a week. <laughs> okay. So this is at the end of the sentence. I eat lunch. No, no recuerdo. Lunch. I eat lunch three times a year. Wow. So this is at the end of the sentence. These ones, these ones are in between. Nation of enter. Yes, Lisa. 
it's kind of funny, but okay. <laughs> Let me see. Um, I always, I always read good books, okay? Always is before the verb. Okay. Yeah. If it's a verb to be, no. But that, that's another thing that we're going to check. Check over here. Uh, she's old and rarely goes out. Okay, rarely goes out. But with the verb to be, let me see. He's always very punctual. He is always. So after the verb, okay? He's always, but he usually, we usually go or we generally go. They often went, okay? So that is the position. But on Sundays, on, hol on holidays, after work, all of those expressions are at the end of the sentence. Okay, don eh, don Ovidio, does that help you? I understand, thank you. Sure, okay. Check over here, so this is the idea. Now let's continue with the other exercise. It's all red now, okay. Somebody told me calaseado, poorcito, right? So but don't worry, let's, that's necessary. Okay, so, do you often do aerobics at the gym? No, I hardly ever do aerobics. Okay, no, I hardly ever do aerobics. Okay, I'm going to say this in Spanish. Nunca usemos negativo con un adverbio negativo. Porque eso sería doble negativo. En inglés, doble negativo no se utiliza. Okay. So double negative, mm -mm, no double negative. Okay, so let's continue. Uh, number four, one volunteer for four. I need two volunteers. Okay. Do you always exercise on Sunday? Excellent. And who wants to answer the question? No, I never exercise on Sunday. Okay, thank you, Don Walter. That's okay. No, I never exercise on Sundays. Okay, excellent. Very good. What about number five? Two volunteers for five? Me. Okay, no. What do you usually do after class? Ah, excellent. What do you usually do after class? And for the answer? I go out with my classmates about three times a week. Perfect. Excellent. Very good. Uh, this question, goes to the end of the sentence. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Can I, can I to say I go usually out with my classmates about three times a week? Oh, no, no. Uh, usually is before the verb. Are you okay? Are you okay? I, I usually go out with my classmates about three times a week. Yes, you can say that. Uh -huh. okay. I go usually or no, or I go out uh -huh. usually no. But here, you can put usually here. I usually go out with my friends about three times a week. Yeah, that one, yes, you can say that. Yes, sir, you can do that. Now, thank you. How about number six? Volunteers for six. Okay, Noemi. Noemi again. All right, thank you. And uh, Luis Alonso Mendoza. Okay, Don Luis, go ahead. Let's be. Noemi begins and Luis continues. Answers. Okay. How often do you usually play soccer? Uh, I usually play soccer about three or four times a week. Perfect, excellent, very good. And now the last one, 
Who wants to do the last one? There are two volunteers. Do you ever go for a walk? Excellent. And who wants to do the answer? No, hardly ever I hate walking. Excellent, very good. Notice that here, no, hardly ever is period. Okay, we say no. No, 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 the hand. no. I, no, I hardly, no, without I, because it's only the short answer, right? No, hardly ever. Period, okay? We finished that part. No, hardly ever. Um, you can answer, you can answer in a short way with these ones. No, hardly ever. Why not? I hate walking. I hate walking. What's the meaning? I don't like walking. I hate walking. Eddie, are you walking? Are you walking, Eddie? Right? So I hate walking. So notice. Uh, do you ever watch TV in the evenings? Always. Okay. Yes. Always. It's okay. Yes. Always. Yes. Almost always. Yes. Usually. Yes. Often. Yes. Sometimes. No. Hardly ever. No. Rarely. No. Seldom. No. Almost never. No. Never. Okay. Like that. In this, this is the short, the short form, one short form. The other short form is, yes, I always do. Yes, I often do. Okay, or no, I rarely do. No, I seldom do. But these are the formal ways or the most formal ways. Okay. So questions about the exercise? Questions about this exercise? No, teacher. No questions for the moment. Okay, let's continue. We say we don't have time for the next exercise, but we can try. <laughs> there are only 12 sentences. Okay, complete the sentences. Okay, one volunteer for number one. Who wants to do one? Yes, Lillian is number one, Rosario is number two. Okay, so okay. Um, Sería or, or teacher, Mr. John, never be for lesson. Oh, how do you conjugate the verb to be? The verb to be is is are. Um, so our teacher, Mrs. Jones, is, is, is never, is never ne late never. for lessons. Is never late for lessons. Okay, so that would be the, the idea. Thank you very much. Now, eh, Doña Rosario Lendes. Okay, I usually clean my bedroom on week. Okay. Uh, let me see, and, the, and then uh, I don't see the, the less uh, word is weekend or week? It's weekends, uh huh. Oh, okay, weekend. Okay, I usually clean my bedroom on, on week. Usually? Okay. Clean my bedroom on week. Uh -huh. I Okay, don't worry, it's okay. No, I open. Okay. <laughs> it's all right, no problem. What about number three? Volunteer for three. My brother hardly ever helps me with my homework. Uh, excuse me, teacher. Uh, I think uh, often is uh, the, um, the um, 
frequency I clean my the bathroom. Correct. Uh, uh -huh. uh, uh, and the answer is uh, for me, mm -hmm. is uh, I usually or oh, every day for often is frequency. Ah, okay. I think that you think that is how often do you clean your bed? Uh -huh. Entonces, I usually, uh -huh. Check over here. Check. Always, almost always, usually, often. Ah, okay. Hardly ever, ever. And the combination, the combination of how and this, how mm -hmm. often, but this is mm -hmm. a frequency. Here we have mm -hmm. it. Okay. The, uh -huh, but, and the uh, uh, top, uh -huh, and uh, the, uh, no, uh, up. Please I clean. I often clean my bedroom on weekends. My uh, but, uh -huh, but, but the often uh, in español, ¿cómo sería? Yo frecuentemente, o ¿cómo sería? Ajá, uh -huh. frecuentemente limpio mi. Eh, Pero como que no da, bueno, para mí, no sé. <laughs> frecuentemente. Limpio mi, mi, mi cuarto todos los fines de semana. Uh -huh. lo puede, pero lo puede traducir. Eh, mucho usamos muy seguido. <risa> yo, yo limpio mi cuarto seguido. Ok. Ajá, va, pero seguido sería como que siempre, always. Seguido es informal, es bien, es muy informal. Si alguien dice mm. seguido, ¿seguido de qué? Okay. No, por, por eso. O sea, por eh, mí, eh, often. Eh, do you see apps uh, in the frequency, please? Con frecuencia. Eh, no, do, uh, do lamina uh, show the, uh, um, the sharing, I, I uh, often play soccer twice a month. Uh, Sometimes I watch, if, uh, if for me, answer I often, Uh -huh. mm, no, uh, 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 no, no concuerda, pues, por decir, porque no hay la palabra. Entonces sería así: I sometimes, o I usually, o I always. Ok. okay. Um, bueno, pongámoslo así: si a usted no le gusta usar often, no use often, use sometimes. O si no, uh -huh. hardly ever. Pero si le aparece uh -huh. un examen, por favor use uh -huh. para que le pongan correcto lo que está haciendo. Uh -huh. No lo usa por preferencia, digamos. Vaya, usted no lo quiere usar porque dice, no, no, me, no eso no me cuadra. Entonces, uh -huh. está bien, usted no lo use. Pero uh -huh. en el examen, si, le, si sucede que le aparece, úselo. Porque si no... Oh, ok, ok. En el examen, ok. But uh, in the in general conversation, another person? Okay. Um, another person will use it. Mm -hmm. But if you want to use it, don't use it. It's okay. That's mm -hmm. fine. Uh -huh. It's optional. Yeah, it's optional. I mean, you use the one that you consider mm -hmm. is mm -hmm. necessary. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Don't worry about it. I often is, we say, si, si lo quiere traducir como con frecuencia limpio mi, ok, mi cuarto, uh -huh. ok, it's ok, that would be like, Now, how about number four, volunteer for four? I am sometimes bored in the math class. Excellent, very good. I'm sometimes bored. I'm sometimes bored in the math class. Very good. Okay, number five, volunteer for five. We are early watch football on TV. Mm, okay, here we use am um because it's the verb to be. But over here, no verb to be. We early watch football on TV. Okay, we rarely, rarely 
watch. Mm -hmm. Excellent, thank you. Thank you very much. What about number six? Volunteer for six? You and oh. Tommy. Oh, sorry. Continue, continue, uh, colleague. Thank you. Uh, you and Tony uh, never play computer games with me. Okay, never play computer games with me. Okay. No, don't. Uh, who was? Don't. Okay. Number seven. You are usually at the sports center on Sundays. Excellent, very good. You are usually at the sports center on Sunday. Very good. Number eight, who wants to do eight? I saw a hand, Alexander Marroquin. Okay, Don Alex, go ahead, please, eight. The school bus mm -hmm. always arrive at half past eight. The school bus always arrives oh. at half past eight. Okay, excellent, very good. Doña Rosario, number nine, please. Thanks. Okay, let me uh, No, I, I forget uh, down my hand, but uh, <laughs> no. Uh, hoy le toco repetición, <laughs> ni modo. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Okay, Doña Claudia Viles, number nine, please. Uh, pupusas are always delicious here. Okay, always delicious. Very good. Thank you very much. All right, nice, nice. What about number 10? Volunteer for they, 10. They never watch TV at night. They never watch TV at night. F fantastic. Number 11, who wants to do 11? Mary seldom okay. goes shopping on Monday. Excellent, very good, seldom goes. goes, right? Seldom goes shopping on Mondays, very good. 12. We generally clean the house on weekends. Fantastic, thank you very much. Okay, excellent, very good. Now with this, we finish. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for your cooperation. Thank you for your patience and your participation, okay? We're going to stop here. God bless you all, sleep well, see you tomorrow, okay? Thank you. See you tomorrow. See you, there, see you tomorrow. Thank you, see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye-bye.